I came here to meet with the General Secretary of Kappa Kappa Epsilon, uh, with Mr. Kutsubas, uh, to brief him on the current situation in Palestine, in occupied Palestine, where in Gaza we have over 38,000 Palestinians killed and over 88,000 injured. We still have over 10,000 Palestinians missing, and this number could be growing because Israel doesn't allow any humanitarian aid workers or UN uh, uh, specialists to come in and uh, view the destruction and uh, to help with uh, the recovery process uh, to remove the rubble, to find uh, people uh, who have been buried in their homes and in their schools. As we all heard uh, yesterday, uh, the school of the Holy Family was totally demolished. This is uh, a school belonging the, to the uh, Latin Patriarchate of Palestine. And before that, uh, in 16 hours, another school was bombed and honor was schooled in Serat refugee camp, where uh, 16 Palestinians were killed and over 80 injured. The, uh, the, uh, the situation is uh, escalating in Gaza. Uh, the intensity of the bombardments by Israel is going uh, without uh, any uh, real condemnation by the international community and without uh, any real uh, uh, viewing by the mainstream media. This is the danger of this situation. Uh, Israel is uh, treated a country above the law that can commit, suicide, uh, can commit genocide against uh, the Palestinian people without uh, condemnation by the international community. Uh, it has become a norm, and this is the, the danger of the situation, that uh, 100, 200 Palestinians being killed every day, mainly women and children, is going unnoticed and without condemnation from the international community. It's as if it has become a norm uh, to watch uh, 200 uh, people die in a day and uh, turn off the TV, and that is okay. Uh, we call on the international community uh, and uh, on world leaders to recognize the state of Palestine, to save the two-state solution, because without the two-state solution, there can be no peace in the Middle East, and there can be no peace in the region. Thank you.